Hello, everybody button. Wait. <laughs> I, uh, yes. We're ready. We're here. We're live. Oh. Oh, hello, Audrey. Hello. How are you? Hello. I am well. Okay. I just decided to go ahead and put Dune up because he hasn't yet learned about the countertops. Mm, okay. Yeah, that seems fun. Yeah. Uh, anyways, it's me. It's Sean. I'm playing Xenoblade Chronicles X. Let's go ahead and start jumping in here. Uh, and with me, I have Audrey, and then also... Tess. Yeah, Tess is here, and... Did you already turn on the Discord yes, audio? Yes, she is actually audible this time, so I, I, I did the correct thing. Woo! And uh, last week, we did some plot stuff so that this week, I can finally take the test to get my robot. Yeah, robot. robot! Tennille is also here, but is working... I'm editing, so I'll be pretty quiet. Yeah, they're editing, drawing a blank, so they probably won't be talking a whole lot. I'll probably just be sketching meanwhile. Okay. I guess while we're here, in this specific spot, I'll go ahead and pick up this quest from... So stenas, so stenasa, so stenasa, yeah. So stenasa, got it. I love the manon; they're amazing. They've got a great design, honestly. They're really cute. I love all, like most of the alien species in this game. Spoilers: like we we get more aliens on our team. Are they, like, yeah. robotic? Uh, this is particular it... guy is just wearing a face mask. Okay. So, he's got a face underneath there. Those ears that are sticking out are his actual ears. I love and you can see a bit of his neck. I don't know what this guy's talking about. Something about how he loves machines and he thinks humans are bad at machines, so... I mean, they are. Here's... Because uh, that's the thing about the man on there. <laughs> Incredibly more intelligent than humans. Aliens. What? Tess, you might be cutting in and out a little bit. Yeah, yeah. My, my internet just cut right there for a second. Oh. It does that. Okay. And I happened to drop something at the same time, so if you heard me make a weird noise. <laughs> Alright, anyways. I think in order to get our robot, or at least do the actual quest to get our robot, we need to head up. Calling elevator. Elevator going up. Near him. Near him. I love just doing this and seeing my teammates like run after me like idiots. Uh, look at these idiots running in circles says the idiot running in circles. I love that in uh, the first Xenoblade 2. Like, if I accidentally jump off a cliff, they're all coming with me. Oh, yeah. They'll 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 follow you no matter what you do. Monkey see, monkey do. Oh, I see quests everywhere. Why are there quests everywhere? I just... I want to get my robot. I definitely think after we get the robot, we're going to spend some serious time doing some side quests. Yeah. Alright, I don't think it's you. Let's see. Side quest for the win. Um, new orders. Scale license. That's what we want. And while we're here, are, are there any other quests in here that we have collected enough of whatever? Nope. Okay. Missions. Scale license. Set this. Where do we go? Oh, we just go back to our barracks. Okay. Oh, okay. That, that's good. Let's go. Gotta get a robot. Gotta get a robot. Hello, everybody, as you're filing in. You've not really missed much. We've just started up, and I need to get my robot license. You, give me robot Hello. license. 
Uh, have a robot license. Excellent. Uh, damn ringer lately. Uh, anyways. Uh, yes. What? I don't care. Uh, I want a scale. Oh, yeah? That's right. I forgot you don't have one. Wait, don't... You don't even have a scale license, do you? Whoops, sorry about that oversight on my part. You need a scale, a license to pilot a scale, you see. We only issue them to Blades with a proven track record. That way we know they have the skill to make use of them. Dude, I've saved your guys' asses multiple times now. Given your track record, I'm tempted to issue one right now, but it ain't the standard operating procedure. Wouldn't be fair to the others, you know? So? So, I don't care, just give it to me. <laughs> but clear the license exam and it's all yours. There are eight things we need to do. Uh, all right, first one, install a data probe at a specific site, okay. Uh, the next one, defeat uh, 12 of those things. Uh, the next one, defeat that specific boss. The next one, uh, obtain a, an item on a specific location. The next one, gather, oh god, bugs from various, lo or like, items from specific places. I'm gonna have to run around Oblivia for a while. Great. Um, next, earn 15,000 credits using the frontier nav. Oh god, I hope I have enough to do that. Uh, the next one, get the weapon from what's-his-face and do that thing. Okay. The next one, complete one of the three quests, the handyman on the pipsqueak, or that's incredible. I think I've already done at least one of those. Uh, once you get your eight certification certifications done, go tell Walter in the hangars. Then, once you pass the final exam, you'll officially be a scale pilot. Pretty exciting, yeah? Ha! Sure is. But getting you in a scale will be good news for Blades, too. I've got high hopes for you. Good luck! Alright, well, I, I've done one of these quests. And I've done two of these quests. And oh, I've done it? three of these quests. Damn, that was it. That's all the quests I've done. Finally! Oh wait, I only did two. Dang it. I just got a package that I was excited about. Cool. I'm gonna all right. for a moment. Uh, how much? All right, now I need to do some research. Let's see. How much Meranium I'm currently making Oh, perfect! I make 15,000 every time I get money, so now I just have to wait for Money to Pile in for that specific quest That's good Alright, so I also need To get an examination Weapon from somebody <sighs> I hate these where you have to like Equip a specific weapon and then go fight something For a while and then that's how it goes A mosquito bit your finger? It keeps happening. Like, different fingers. I'll bite the top of my fingers. Like, up around the knuckle. That's so strange. And I'm so sorry this happens to you. It happens too much. You, Get give me this crappy weapon I need to use. They're not supposed to be in my room. Get out. Alright. All right, defeat three giant Grexes um, with the knife. Uh, defeat the Grexes with the assault rifle or the Grexes with the sword. I don't use any of these. <laughs> Why would they do this to me? Make it harder to get your robot. My team members don't use those weapons either. Hold on. Can you pull that the door back out a little bit? I think the fan was like sucking oh. up the blanket and it wasn't working very well. It was getting kind of noisy. Uh-huh. 
All right, so if I do a teleport, not there. That's not fair. So where's food coming from then? KFC. KFC? Okay, yep. cool. I'm assuming they have not picked it up yet? Nope. Okay. I will look forward to consuming it once it arrives. Hooray! 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 Da 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 da! Alexa! Play Despacito and get on my team. Let's do this. Lao is cool and all, but Alexa is cooler. All right, let's go. She's called Alexa. Exactly. Now, this is what I'm going to see. Alexa, I'm going to give you this trial assault rifle <laughs> and see if Here's I can get away with having a team member use the weapon. Here's a gift. Oh crap, I got a new weapon. A new lightsaber. That's got a lot of awesome abilities on it. Alright, we're wielding this new lightsaber. I'm okay with this. Alright, oh, I should also put on some better armor. That seems like a good idea. Put on that. Hmm. And that. Just looking for the biggest numbers, honestly. As promised in the first game, I have all my characters dressed as silly as possible. Do it. Except really the girls. I'm trying to make them look nice. The boys, though, silly. <laughs> Ryan rarely ever gets to wear a shirt. I mean, as it should be. I feel like that's how he would dress. Well, of course. Especially once you get to, like, the winter location. Yes. He complains about how cold he is all the time. I'm just like, well, maybe if you put on a shirt. Oh, wait a minute. Um... No shirt for you. Poor Charlotte, who has so many skimpy options. <laughs> I'm just like, no, she needs to be warm. Yeah. I wish she had better clothing options. She has a, like a real nice pair of pants that I really liked, and then I turned it ar around, and I was like, "Oh, there's her butt." Yep. There's no, there's no back to these pants. <laughs> yeah, she has a lot of like assless chaps and just That's why <laughs> bad clothes. All right. Well, this is not. Ideal. If I'm being honest. Oh, these owls don't give a crap about me. Okay, that's a little more ideal. Now, is it this side of this Grex I'm unable to run past? Yes! <laughs> Stupid Grex, not looking the correct direction. Okay. So let's find these Grexes we need to kill. Those. And 
now our lightsaber looks like a pink axe thing. It actually it looks like a halo weapon. Friends, nobody needs to know that we're here. Oh. Hi, Jeff. Wow. I don't have any more attacky sword attacks right now. Elma, I can't do that. Stop asking for it. Okay, there we go. does work. It does work! Seeing there on the side, I've defeated two of the three with the weapon, and uh, it doesn't mean I have to wield it, as long as a teammate is wielding it. Alright, I'm, I'm cool with this. Alright, there's gotta be, like, another one around here, right? Hello? Friends, and you said no. Ugh. Okay, fine. There's another group of them up this direction. Oh, there we go. I just got the money. So I completed that other quest. Yeah. I've completed three out of the eight things now. these stupid Grexes. Where are you, you silly dog wolf things that are alien? I guess technically we're the aliens. Yeah. Oh, there they are. They're up there. How do I get up there? I think I get up there from over here. Always nice to have a way around a forced bad weapon. Yes, indeed. You know, this is the second time we've used Alexa to wield a shitty weapon while we can just continue to be awesome. Wild kitty ears! I just got wild kitty ears! All right, let's do it. We can be a cat, nya nya. Yeah. One of my team D groups said that they want to make their character into a cat girl. And I was like, well, you gotta say nya all the time in our DM just because I will kill you on the spot. Okay, nya. <laughs> Pretty much how Jay responded. I did it. Now we just need to take out this thing. And then we can get Alexa a better weapon.
dead. Okay, now... Submenu, change fashion gear with wild kitty ears. Oh, they're even black! Oh, no, wait, they're like white with black tips. Still works. Whatever, doing it. We're a cat now, Yanya. Uh Okay. You know, I'm gonna drop a save just for the hell of it. Alright. I see you guys are talking about the red tail thing. I cannot believe that is a thing that happened today. In it's the year so of good. 2020. It's so good! It's about time Red Tail paid for his crimes. Just. Okay. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh crap. Oh Watching god. Huh? Oh god. No, it's dead. I I did not realize there was yeah, a was crocodile waiting. there. I was waiting for the string to catch up. I was like, what's wrong? Oh. <laughs> uh, a crocodile ate my face. Oh, it happens. All right, this time we're going to run behind the crocodile that is sight-based. You know, I don't even know what kind of creature it is we're fighting. I don't remember what a blatta is. Mm. Oh, they're just tiny bugs. Okay then, kill the tiny bugs. There's more bugs here. Good. There's something else that was going on, and it was like red cancel party or red something cancel party. And then I think somebody was like red tail. Oh. Welcome back. These things are level 11. I am not using my precious TP uh, to use an aura against level 11 bugs. Okay. Now to run to the other side of the map where there are more bugs. Been saying anything? Or I'm right, your bugs going uh, fucked. Not immediately, not right now, no. Okay. Here, water. Now uh -oh. she said something. Nope. Can't hear. Your bugs are defunct. Hold up. <laughs> oh, you know, I remember where these. 
where these buggos are. Ugh, now I hear. Here. Somet sometimes my computer decides to identify my earbuds as something else randomly while I'm in the middle of using them. It's really fun. <laughs> it's technology. So, like, it's the same thing, but it's like, has slightly different wording around it. Then suddenly Discord's like, oh, that's not the thing anymore. Yep. Oh, I get that. <laughs> Oh, four out of twelve of these stinking bugs. Oh, there's one. Kill it. Kill the bug. Make it dead. Alright, while well, you guys keep fighting that one, I'm going to come over here and start fighting this one so we can expedite the process of killing all the bugs. Alright. Cool. Halfway through. The bugs. Not getting the robot yet. But Man. We're getting closer. Sean, I keep I think I feel like this is this is like a strip tease, but it's about a robot. <laughs> well, you know what? I can only go through the game so quickly. <laughs> they really do tease the robot though. Oh, immediately. They're like, oh man. When are you gonna get that robot? That cool little robot. Most people quit the game before they even get close to it. I know. Mm -hmm. This game is very long. I say most people. I mean. <laughs> She finally just opened my package, even though I meant to open it while I was downstairs. <laughs> Said I talked everybody else's ears off. Like I do. You know what's frustrating? Is I will have killed all but one of the bugs I need to kill. And then I'm gonna have to warp somewhere to reload one more bug. Why would they do this to me? I cannot put it up on the map. Let's do that in the first thing you do. I have 11 out of the 12 bugs. Why? I'm gonna quickly run over here, see if there's like another bug right here. No? Damn. You know what, actually there's a, a funny thing that appears here. Funny thing. Where are you? I want to fight you. That's not the bunny thing, that's just small bunnies. There it is. Like, I don't remember if I did actually kill this bunny squirrel thing earlier. Bunny fox. Definitely not a bunny, it's a fox. Squirrel. Whatever. Yeah, uh, pop uncle. Pop fancy. Hmm. Green fox thing. Either way, I'm going to kill it now. It's dead. I killed it. Yeah, everything about this game is just like, man, won't it be cool once you get a robot? Yeah, sure would, game. <laughs> All right, maybe I will have traversed far enough away 
that if I run back through this cave, there will be a bug. One bug. Singular bug. Fuck. Okay, okay, fine, fine. I'll do a quick teleport and do it again. Go back, Jack. Do it again. In uh, the first game, and I saved it and stopped for the day. And then the next time I opened it, the boss had respawned. Like the moment I opened the game. Oh no! <laughs> so it's like, oh hi friend. Time to do this again. Boss music played immediately. I was not ready. Oh, I believe it. Fifty hours in, so I'm getting there. Slowly. Okay. That's another one down. Oh, that's five out of eight. Okay, I'm actually I'm getting there. Oh, only three left. Okay, so defeat a specific boss that rarely appears. Why would you do that? work for that robot. Uh, I mean, I'm going to. I'm absolutely going to. Oh, okay, I teleported. Cool. I was just checking the internets quick. Now to find out if I was lucky. Oh, I found a landmark. Well, that makes it easier. there! Yes! It appeared the first time. I was lucky. Shatseek the Flash? It's a... Uh, it's a flying manta ray narwhal. I like it. It's fine for a terrifying sea creature, I guess. I like terrifying sea creatures. I don't. <laughs> Ow. There you go. Heal up, Alexa. I forgot that you actually had a team name, mem member named Alexa, and I was like, why does Alexa need to heal up? She mean power up, Sean? Gosh. She's a machine, not a human being. Actually, wait, that still is true. Healing and dream. This thing is not really doing a whole lot to us, so I'm not super scared of it. At least not at this point. Yeah, I'm not too sure how long that's gonna last, Sam. Oh, it ran away. Oh. Come back here! Sir! Sir, we are in a battle? You want me to do another aura? Oh, god, it's... It's in the ocean, where I cannot fight it. Uh... Oops, I, I meant to not heal myself, but okay, here we are. I'm in the water. So that's its gig. Come here, you stupid fish. Oh, there we go, there we go. Whenever
whenever it does like that charging attack, that's when I get the chance to get at it again. Oh. Just gotta hope it's not stupid and charge off into the sea again. Man, my teammates are all about me using these auras. Hey, I did it! I finally broke its nose. Can't you change what one they can say? Uh, I think so. I've, I've never really done it. I know you, like, pulled it up one time and mentioned it is why I brought it up. <laughs> and they were like, I'm not going to mess with this. And I was like, that's fair. Yeah, that, I, that, that's exactly it. It's like, I don't want to mess with this, so I won't. I... I don't know if there's anything else to break on this. On um, the beastie. Well, that's frustrating. Yeah. I'd love to break other bits on it, but I don't know what to break. Like, I'm, I'm walking around. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Tail. Fight ah, tail. Alright. Oh, it's dead. Oh, man. It would be great if you could have find it, could have found it when it was still at that like third of hell. But it is hard to find those spots sometimes. Yep, especially if you don't know where they are. Do the unique beasts respawn in this game? They do. In what fashion do they respawn? Uh, reload the area, and then they have a chance of being back already. Oh, okay. Yep. I don't remember if they respawn in the original Xenoblade Chronicles. I don't remember. I know in 2 they have a tombstone where they were and you can just refight them whenever you want. Right. I think that system is nice. It is a nice system. I agree. Okay. I am... Um... Right. Mission. Obtain the solar starship map in Noctilum's Humdrum Peaks. Okay. Go to this place. Get the thing. Now, the real question is, am I close enough to this thing to actually get it pretty quickly? Oh, it's down there. Wee! Thump. Oh. Hello, crab. How are you? I just jumped out of nowhere. You having a good day? Do you want your day to end? Forever? Forever. <laughs> With the chance of respawning. Now it's dead. Alright. Give me the thing. Got it. Walk through the space door. Yeah. Actually, while I'm down here... I know I have one more quest to do, but I know there's a chest right around here. I want to see if I can open it. Why can I not open chest? Wait, did that crab want to fight? Is that what's going on here? Oh, what? Fine, I'll kill the crab. It 
just want to open the chest, Mr. Crab. You didn't have to die. I just wanted the formula, Mr. Krabs. You didn't have to die. I just wanted the Krabby Patty formula. Yeah, I can't do a plaintive voice at all, so I'm glad you did that. <laughs> Me, doesn't even like Spongebob. Makes a Spongebob joke. I mean, I'm not like a crazy fan of it either. The light. I don't think Spongebob is bad, but it it's it's I, not really something I grew up watching. I actively hated yeah, it as a I kid. did. <laughs> I thought I did, and then I went back and rewatched it and I was like, you know what? I was wrong. This is actually some pretty funny shit. <laughs> I've like watched some clips these days and I'm just not not into it. Yeah. It's, it's just not my thing. All right, we need to get three bag flea squashes. In Oblivia, we have one. Leaving you. Oh boy. All right, so hold on just a second. Bagley squash. Dino Blade. Ah, there. Ah. Right. Cool, we get to go to somewhere we haven't been yet. Ooh, nice. Because it's got the highest spawn rate of the item we want. Cool, cool, cool. Whee! No, wait, that's a waterfall. Can I go that way? I cannot see from this particular map. Yeah, no, that's a waterfall. I can't go that way. Wait. Uh, I could go that way, maybe. Uh, you know what? It's going to be easier to... All right, we're, go we're, we're approaching from a different direction. All right, we're at the ring. Time to run. Run, 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 run. Hopefully not die as we run around. It could very easily happen. Especially seeing as the area that we're going to has a lot of high level creatures that could eat my face. They're not a fan of robot people here. Oh, no. They're not a fan of my face in particular. I somehow have already collected one of these items, and we've not been to this one specific area. Whoop. But that's the thing, is like, it could technically appear anywhere in Oblivia. Just more likely to show up here? Yeah. There's a lake in the top right corner of this map, which is where we are going. And this lake has the best chances. Oh god. Yep. Okay, they're they're not aggressive. It's fine. They're just popping in to say hi. Hello. There's some pretty blue flowers. Hello. Hmm. I like the friend, and friend. Oh. oh god, friend. Oh. Level 41, friend. Oh. Level 41, aggressive, friend. Oh. I think you see an alien. Yeah. 
They're cool scorpion things. Alright, I really want this Moranium deposit. So we're going to parkour! Parkour! Yeah! Ha 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 ha! Ah, can't stop me and my parkour skills. I know technically you're supposed to run up that ridge, but I don't have time for that. I if you could jump up. Exactly. Oh no. This is the dead end. Oh no. This is a dead end. Well, time to die. Oh god! Level 48 unique scorpion. Run away. Just dropped out of the sky. <laughs> yep. So I was hello. right. Time to die. Sorry, who are you saying hello to? Scorpion the or one, did someone else? The one that dropped out of the sky. Yeah, the big okay. scorpion. Okay. I wasn't sure if someone else joined the chat. No, I have to talk to the computer monsters. Okay. I, I mean, at least we got that new Moranium deposit. That's cool. Oh, God, I'm going to die. Oh, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Run, run, run. Uh, no, dead. Oh, no. Okay, we're going to teleport. Alright. It's cool. Alright, we're back at the ring again. We're gonna go a different direction. The big moon. Where are these spiders coming up from? There's no... Uh, the ring that's like a thousand miles ahead above us. Oh. Space. Space spiders. Space. Not quite space, but pretty close to it. Space! Space spiders. I mean, we're still on a different planet. These are still space spiders. I believe. Okay, I know this crevasse. Wow! Stupid bug. Plant. Thing. I just want to get to the lake. I like that you also call it a crevasse. As I, compared uh, to a crevice? Yeah. Uh, Matt Mercer said crevasse all the time and people gave him a hard time for it. He's like, I've always said it. There's it nothing wrong with crevasse. No, it's a white space. But you know how people are. Same with uh, sigil. He said sigil. Okay, I say sigil. <laughs> I say sigil. Okay. <sighs> Great. I'm glad we have stupid plant things to worry about as well. Like, they don't really hurt, they're just kind of annoying. Ooh, a level 28 unique monkey. That seems quite large. Oh, he's sprinting. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh lordy okay. coming. You know what? I don't care about this stupid plant. I'm going to ignore it. Hey, big guy, how's it going? Not too bad. Just walking around as I do. Kind of like a big turtle. I always see him as like ants. Ah, uh, yeah. Large int.
keep running and running and running and running. Oh, right. Now there's birds that'll just swoop out of the sky in this area. Oh, God. Level 70 unique lion. He's big. He's scary. He wants to eat my face. Oh. More hidden enemies in, from the ground. Excuse me, sir, but I do not wish to stay here. Sir, how about we don't? I, I have no way to prove it, but I feel like some of these gigantic plants, tree things, are enemies in disguise. Oh, yeah. That'd be great. But, like, they might only activate if you have a skell. Hmm. I guess that would make sense, because it'd kind of be impractical to fight them with normal... Mm -hmm. And, like, their AI would not be, like... Or their AI. Them as living creatures would not see a small human thing as a threat. Alright, we got level 40. Oh god, no, 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 run, run, sprint, go! Oh god! Please, I'm so close. I'm getting so close. I can, I can almost taste the lake. I can, <laughs> I can see the lake water. Let me into the water. All right, I'm s I, I, I made it. I'm still technically in the fight, though. <laughs> Stop chasing me. Ah, oh, it's still chasing me. Okay. Hush. It is no longer chasing me. Let's come out here and get this landmark. Landmark! It's a caravan of Nopon! The ribs are interesting because there's a creature at D&D &D that hides in the sand and it just looks like a rib cage sticking out. But if you hmm. walk into it, it, it'll it catch you in the rib cage like a Venus flytrap. Oh! That's Howdy, terrifying partner. terrifying in multiple ways. Lunari has dealt with one of those before. Have I mentioned I am I am terrified of Lunari? <laughs> that is most of my group now. I don't know what this guy needs other than do this thing for this dude. Okay. I do that too. I'm just like yeah 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 yeah. I'll go do it. It's like yeah yeah yeah. I don't know. You're you're not important. Oh, I got another bag flea squash. And then I actually look at the quest and I'm like, wait, what do they want me to do? Wait, what? They just want me to go talk to somebody? Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to reload. Recollect these items. Did not get a bag flea squash. Do it again. Uh, Twitch? Hmm? Twitch? Are you okay? Us. I think there's a very pretty thing to watch on a different server. Okay. okay. Is Twitch still fine? Uh, I'm assuming so, but I honestly haven't checked. My playback was buffering there for a little bit. I just want to make sure that it's okay. It doesn't look like I've dropped any frames. Okay, I, I think we're good. I still have internet. Yeah. I think we're good, too. I'm just gonna double check. I'll hear you. Oh, that's good. Sound off in the chat if I still exist. I and I just checked the stream audio. I just heard myself. So <sighs> streams looking good. Bag flea squash. We just did it. Guess Yay! what this means? We can get a robot. But first, I'm gonna swim across this lake in a very slow, painful way, and then hopefully get another uh, meranium deposit. 
Because I know there's one right on the other side of this lake. Ivy says you exist. You exist, Sean. Oh, you valid. I'm, I'm glad you valid. that I take. I'm glad that I exist. <laughs> you Thank matter. you. Thank you. Bitrate seems to be taking a hit. Hmm. Well, it looks. It, it looks like OBS is exporting correctly, so I'm going to guess that's the thing on Twitch's yeah, end maybe, that I cannot control. Maybe refresh it, because it, it did kind of refresh for me and it looks okay. Mm, no, don't look this way, don't look this way! Don't look this way! Oh god! Why are there- Oh, God! There are big, scary beasties that want to have me for their supper. And I am not okay with any of it. Hello? Ooh, woo. Anyone back here? Ah, oh, I did it. I did it. I did it! Ha! Ah. Okay. Wait, no, uh, teleport to, wait, no, actually, uh, missions. Figure out where I need to go. Teleport to, there. Now, before you get your robot. What? Supper is here. <sighs> Oh. oh. Well, oh. everybody, commercial break time. Yeah. And, and we've it's been going a good for an hour. Time for a break. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, we're about to get our robot. Like, I literally just need to walk right. Uh, I know. I shouldn't have said anything, Chad. I'm sorry. Right there. I just need to talk to Walter and we get our robot. But we're going to take a commercial break. <laughs> Uh, this will give people a chance to go get a snack, maybe a drink of water or something, get some food, take a stretch, do a bathroom. Uh, I'm going to play some ads. Um, yeah, we're going to renovate an entire bathroom right now. Go! Yes. I I'm going to run some ads so that uh, I can get paid for doing all this awesome content. If you let those play, I think that'd be awesome. And I'm going to get some yeah. food, and I'll be back in just a little bit.
Okay. We back. Oh, like wait. Him. Hold on. I'm going to walk away for just a second. Oh, no. <laughs> Realized you needed a drink, huh? Cucks. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Uh, we've been playing it playing in loose term here. Uh, a lot of Kingdom Hearts Dark Road for the phone, aka we set the boys up to fight and then we walk away for hours on end. And I've just had that going in the background and then I saw that uh, the tablet was uh, almost dying so I had to go plug it in. I think you've been doing that since like noon. Oh well, yeah, <laughs> it's good. All right, we're back. And now it's time to see if we can get ourselves a giant robot. Walter! Giant robots all across the sky! Van Damme said you'd be stopping by to take the license exam. Um, we did the thing. Here. Yep, full set. Nice work. Well, our, here's the final exam. No need to stretch, though. Just a simple verbal quiz. We had you run missions for each of the eight divisions, but and there's a reason for that. Care to guess what it might be? Uh, say it was to better understand the role each division played within Blade... Uh, yeah. Yeah, you did it. Uh, how you can put a skill to use. Anyway, that's one reason, but there's another. There aren't exactly enough skills to go around all of the divisions. Something, something. You might have to work for the other divisions, a.k.a. do whatever the hell you want. Yep, cool. Whatever. Now you can get your own skill. I'd also like to share some good news. Looks like you're being given a free skill. Compliments of Vanda. It's parked in the hangar in the back. Go introduce yourself and give it a test ride. Oh, wow. Thank you, Walter. Just doing my own job. Really, Vandom is the one you should be thanking. He must expect big things from you. It's a rare day a rookie pilot gets issued a scale free of charge. I look forward to seeing what you do with it. Robot. Robot. I want my robot. Robot, 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 robot. Oh, we get robot. a piece of animation. Robot, 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 robot. Can't even see the head because of the gun. Ah, uh, listen to that dramatic music play that I, I, I can't actually hear. Is this my robot? Is this moment actually here? Really I forgot happened? we had the cat eyes. Cat oh my ears god. In the cat eyes. <laughs> <laughs> robot. We did it! We got a giant robot! <laughs> Doug's advice. Welcome to the club, scale pilot. Before you hop into a cockpit, you need to register your scale. Once a. Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Now he says that, but we're inside our giant robot. Ah, oh, giant robot. You know, look at our teammates. So tiny down there. Yes! Go, giant robot, go! Jump! Oh, yes! Oh, I almost fell to my death. <laughs> All right, now... No giant robot is complete without the ability to do a transformation sequence. Clickly cluck clack cluck. Hell yeah. And now we're a motorcycle. Hell yeah! This is how you go fast. Psycho yum! 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 Yum time. Okay, the camera's freaking out a little bit. <laughs> it's like, what are you doing? Unfortunately, to do jumps, you have to turn back into the robot form. So it's oh. a little weird. Yeah. Fast transformation, though. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Oh yeah, if you want, you could just like transfer, transform on the go, and you just, you, you just go. It's great. Just yum. Yum for days. Yum. Oh, I got a giant robot. Now we gotta deck it out and make it all awesome and ours. Yeah. <clears throat> <coughs> Sorry, a little bit of food fun there. All right, so 
inside our base, we can click on this thing and go to the barracks hangar. From here, we can look at our robot. And we can register it, aka put it on anybody we want. That is a high enough level to do it. But it's ours. This is our robot. We're also no, going to rename our robot because uh, the, the, the name it had was just a bunch of letters and numbers and I don't give a crap about that. What's the robot's name? Well, I guess we'll find out. It's on the game pad. Gotta get that game pad action in, man. Sense. Nintendo got a Nintendo. Yeah. The robot's name is Denim. But in like <laughs> leet speak. That's perfect. It's the denim. Mm -hmm. All right, and all right, let's change the gear. Uh, well, that's just a better gun, so put that on. And uh, we have the assault rifle, or we have this beat stick. So we have gun and gun, or we have gun and beat stick. Uh, oh god, I don't know. Yeah, okay, we'll have sniper rifle and beat stick. Uh, let's see, what else do we have? What has big numbers? That has big numbers. That has even bigger numbers. Orange. All right. Now we have all these other slots of things that we need to go buy <laughs> because our robot does not have enough equipment on it. Now we got double beam sabers. Laser. Okay, so what kind of coloration do we want to give our robot? Because we have a lot of customization available. Purple with the orange. I mean, green the beam sabers are honestly nice. going to be hidden most of the time. Uh, well, the green looks nice too. I mean, we could put orange on our body. Oh. Yeah. Darken those blacks a little bit more. And then... Give ourselves Ooh. some bright orange stripes. I'm getting very good Splatoon vibes from this color combo. <laughs> Alright, uh, what are we doing now? What what section is this? Section 4. Okay, well, let's find out what it is. Oh, there we go. It's like the kneecaps. J just the kneecaps? Oh, and a little bit back there. Okay. It's hinges, it seems. Punk? Someone wants punk. Mm -hmm. Actually, if we pull down the saturation, it should turn into more like an off... off-white. Yeah. Yeah, that works. It's it's such a small section. Yeah. Alright, visor. Uh, honestly, I think I want to make this orange. Yeah. 
it's, again, a very small part. It's just the little eyeball part there. And now, lights. So we got some... Gotta be some lights on here somewhere. Yeah, on the side of the back sword thing. Oh, See? yeah, yeah. So we can change that color as well. I say we make that more of like an indigo purple. You know what I mean? Like a yeah. something more like this? Yeah. A bit more royal blue, because it'll glow really cool in the night. That's true. And then it has a decent contrast, but is still like in the same color scheme you already got. All right, and then we can update that. Yes, please. Oh, actually, we can also change the finish. We currently have a gloss finish, but we can also change it so it's a matte finish. Hmm. Just depends on if we want it to be shiny or not. I like shiny. Yeah, I definitely yeah. think we want shiny. And now we can sell our robot. <laughs> God, All right, why? goodbye forever. <laughs> okay. So if we actually come over here, we can see our robot just standing here. We cannot get inside our robot while it's inside the building. And there's room here for three more robots for our teammates. Ooh. Unfortunately, every other robot you get, you, ha you, you have to buy it. Oh. You have to buy the other robots, and they're expensive. Like, oh. r really expensive. Only I get the robot, then. Well, that's the thing. You save up your money. Or, like, you save up your money, you buy a new robot, and then you pass your old robot on to the next person, and you get the new robot. <laughs> So if we come down. over to this thing, we can actually buy scale frames. Boom. Oh, you, you know, we actually have enough money, we could buy any of these. The problem is, we are not high enough level to wield any of these robots. Where do I see the level? Oh, yeah, frame level is the level you have to be to actually jump inside and use this robot. So this guy is level 30, also level 30. This is like identical to the one we have. This one's like a smoother version of the bike. Uh, this is another light frame. I don't know if I've ever bought this particular one. This is a medium type. It turns into more of a car compared to uh, a, a motorcycle. Hmm. And here's another medium type, again, about the same. Uh, and then we get into the heavy types. And uh, they're tanks. They just turn into tanks. Like That's what the, I want. <laughs> oh, yeah, I love this thing. Like, it's just got giant tank treads in the back there. And these front, like, leg bits are also just tanks. I love this robot. I like the one you have right now better, personally. Ugh, <laughs> oh, no. When it comes to robots, I want the biggest, tankiest thing possible. Unfortunately, like, we can buy it, but we don't have the money for it. Or, like, we're not the high enough level yet. So I'm not going to buy another scale yet. Just let, let it sit there. Mm-hmm. The first robot you're given is level 100. Or, er, level, level 25. Boop. Alright, so let's go ahead and buy. Oh, here we go. We could buy a sword. You know, I think I might buy this sword instead of the stupid boop stick. Oh, wait, that was instead of the sniper. Crap! All right. Well, then. All right, instead of the stupid boop stick, uh, we'll put our sniper rifle back on. Back weapons! Here we go. This is stuff we don't have yet. We can currently only afford this laser gun, this missile, or this rail gun. Uh, let's buy a rail gun. And then on the other side... 
Oh, oh, we can actually buy some things that are so big they take up both slots. Oh, man. What is this thing again? What does this do? Uh, inflicts re physical resist down, inflicts stun, grants total evasion versus mechanoids, absorbs fuel. Ah. Cool. I like I like fight things. What is this? Oh, it's just a big ass javelin. Or I could buy. Oh, okay. Actually, I really like this thing. The buster. No. Oh. Deals physical damage, inflicts taunt versus topple targets, boosts damage. It's just Here. a big ass axe, if I remember correctly. Perfect. I'm gonna purchase that. That means that that last cannon we just bought we can't use, so that's a little yeah. sad. Yeah, exactly. All right, now shoulder things. We got missiles, grenade, uh, inflict sleep, uh, deals thermal dagger the damage and inflict stagger. Yes. All right, now for the other shoulder. We could just get another one of the things that we just tackle people with. Uh, maybe we'll change it up. Uh, let's get some missiles. Alright, now for our wrists, we can get, like, melee attack up, ranged attack up, potential up, grants physical resist up, and restores appendage HP... Grants beam resist up. Uh, okay. Uh, let's do melee attack up because I definitely think that's something we're more likely to use. And potential up, probably? Or should we do one of these healy bits? Um, I mean, Physical resist you up, have yeah. a good heal? Uh, not really, but I'm buying something. All right. Now, I can technically buy different heads and stuff, but, like, I honestly don't think it changes the look of the robot at all. It's just for armor. Yeah. And I'm less concerned about that. Okay. I want to look cool and smash things. There we go. Now Robot. denim is fully decked out. And it only took half of our money. <laughs> Worth it. You. Give me your quest. I don't know what you're doing. Yep. Uh-huh. Oh. Cool. Diving body wear. Alright. Thanks for the quest. All right, let's let's do a quest. Get inside my robot. Let's go explore. We're gonna do some quests now. Da 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 da. We. Oh my god, I have so much big crap on top of this robot. It's great. We. Oh. Just slam into everything. Well, we're Worth down here it. now. There you go. I live here now. Spin in circles. We. Oh, I love my robot. Oh, we got robot. I'm so happy about the robot. All right, let's see if I can get. How many hours in did it take to get it? Uh, too many. <laughs> okay, I can't get out. Do you know what this means? <laughs> We teleport. As I say, you warp. Uh 
Nom nom nom. So when you are inside a skell, some enemies will change if they'll attack you or not. Like for example, this yeah. thing will not attack us when we're on foot. But if I'm inside my skell, it will you're absolutely attack me. Mm -hmm. You're bigger and you're clearly a threat. Exactly. Because you're all colorful and pretty. And ginormous. All right, let's do it. Fight! Oh, I forgot to equip my uh, my sword instead, or my sniper instead of my boop stick. Oops. Tackle! Boom! All right, and another thing as a robot is you can hold uh, an enemy in place and just make it so they can't do anything for a bit. It's nice. Oh, and sometimes it randomly switches, so it's an inside-the-cockpit view. Don't ask me why. Huh. That's a strange choice. Mm-hmm. Well, I will be right back. I'm gonna grab a quick shower. Okay. Alright, enjoy. Hashtag bathroom content. Yes, hashtag bathroom content. <laughs> No, we are not taking the street to the bathroom chat. It's not a field trip day. I also have no idea what the chat is saying because I have not pulled up for Probably do that. Probably Tackle! Oops, uh, I did not bind. There we go. Now I'm floating in the air. physical moves. Giant axe again. Boom. Ha ha ha. Oh, I love it. Tackle. Boom. I love my giant robot. It's the best part of this game. We're so cool. Oh, yes. It's attacking my teammates, even though it should definitely be fighting me. <laughs> Maybe it's like, I'll deal with the tiny things, then I can deal with the big, stupid thing. All right, let's finish this off with another giant axe. Got it. Yes. And that is how you giant robot. All right, let's get out. Bleep. What's up, lady? Uh, what are we doing? Oh, you're racist. Oh. You're racist. I hate you. You stupid.
stupid lady. Uh, absolutely disagree. Say the men on are clearly not hostile. You dumbass bitch. Oh yeah, swap the thing for the sniper. Thank you for reminding me. I have to go all the way back is the biggest problem with that. That seems not a like, good game design. <laughs> oh wait, actually I might be able to do it from here. Oh, she seemed a little sad, like a real person, but no, I'm gonna continue to be racist. Uh, can I... Menu... No... Party... Skell gear! Oh, I can just do... I, I can just do it from here. Good. Oh, what a disaster cat will be. Sword, get rid of this stupid rod. Oh, we have an assault rifle. I don't care about that. Give me the sniper rifle. Okay. Where's my robot? There's my robot. It's very important that I don't lose my robot. I mean, oh, yeah, that means you can just like leave it parked somewhere out in the world, right? Yes, but if you teleport somewhere, it comes with you. Oh, it does. Yep. Thank God, it's not like the horses from uh, Breath, Breath of the, of the Wild. Wild. You know, if you ran out of fuel, it would be a lot more realistic if it did just stay out there. Oh yeah, I guess that's something to point out. There on the side, I have Skell Fuel. It very slowly will refill if you're not inside the robot. Yep. Yep. Oh, almost made it. Yep. Ah, there we go. <sighs> good, good, good. God, I love giant robots. They make getting around so much easier. I mean, clearly the world was designed with them in mind, too, which helps a lot. Mm-hmm. Okay. Where is this lady? Am I just walking around her? There. Boop. What's up? Yo, what's up, danger? Boing. Um. <clears throat> Good, you got over your racist bits, I think, maybe. Need to go fight a thing. Well, first I gotta eat more food. You say that, and I should also be eating my food, and I've just not been. <laughs> you should eat more food. I should. You're right. Stuff it in your face. I'm trying. I'm trying. I just have all these ideas, Sean. Okay. God, you just get around so quickly with the robot. I will not stop praising the robot, so don't even try to make me.
I was about to say, I don't know why I would, and then I was like, oh, you know, I, you know, I probably would, just to make fun of him. <laughs> nope. Don't fight it. Run. Get out of there. Nyeom. Oh, God. Zoomy, zoomy. Oh. Oh. Wee. <laughs> Crunch. God, I just love this robot. Oh. I could actually install it from inside here. Oh, cool. I thought you would have been able to do that. That's nice that it lets you. Boop. There, got it. Have I mentioned that I love my robot? No, not yet. Because I really, really do. Cool story, bro. Tell it again. Hey, I love my robot. <laughs> it's pretty fine. Phew! I got gun. So I can fight from back here. Ah, oh, look at my robot. It's pretty great. be pretty great if you could like heal up but you can't because uh i have my own robot <laughs> and it only heals itself so sad for you people that don't have robots wow now gene floors is just an elitist asshole again uh yeah because i have a robot <laughs> do you have a robot i don't think so oh alexa's dead well. That's so sad. Play Despacito. Oh, wait. You're dead. You can't. You know, if you had a robot, maybe you wouldn't be dead. Finding the enemy just means that they cannot do anything for a little bit, and that could be super useful. Sometimes, it, or depending on which game you're in, it, sometimes it just means they can't move from that spot. They can still attack, but with can't. the robot specifically, they can't do anything. Okay. That's nice. That's that's really really nice. It means you can't be fighting with your giant robot while you're doing it, but it does mean your friends can just get in for, like, free damage. Tackle! Boom! Which always leads to the ability to just grab it again. Ha ha ha! Oh, it staggered me. Why would it do such a thing? No, well, maybe because it keeps putting it in vines. Well, I just broke its mouth. <laughs> it can't be mad at me anymore. Really? It can't? Nope, absolutely not. Can't be That's the rules. Have a mouth. Tackle! Can all your companions have skills? Absolutely. Eventually, you can have everybody on your team in a robot. But you have to make them runs first. I gotta buy out that many robots, though, and everyone has to be the correct level to do it. The correct level being 30. I mean, technically, my other teammates can wield this robot. Because this one's only level 20 or something. But why would I give one of my teammates the robot when 
I can have the robot. Yeah, you weren't kidding when the robots were late game and the level cap is level 50. Yeah, I know. It's stupid. It's like, wow. I have to wait this long before we get the robots. I keep forgetting that the level cap is 50 in this game. It really throws me off. Because mm -hmm. the game itself feels very long. But then the level cap is 50. Yeah, you easily hit the level cap before you get to the end of the game. Or, I guess in the first time I played it, uh, I was at level 50 and was still absolutely struggling to fight the final boss. Yeah. Part of that probably has something to do with the fact that I don't know, like, how any of the systems of this game really work. Or, I, I understand how a lot of them work, but I don't know them well enough to exploit them correctly. So, like, the final boss is doing stuff, and we're like, I, I, I don't know how to compete, uh, combat this. Hit it harder. Good old combat is good old hit it till it dies. Mm-hmm. I don't care what it looks like, make it dead. Make it dead! I did it. I made it dead. Yay! Sean has saved us all, everyone. Can you name their skills? Yes, you can name everyone's skills. Yep. Yep. You know, I'm a little sad I can't hear the music that plays when you're in the skill. Because if I remember correctly, it's quite silly. And jump! Where am I jumping to? Wait. No. Hold on. Sean, you probably should have figured this out before you jumped. Oh, it's on that one. I went off the wrong cliff. Oh, Sean. It's fine. I mean, it is fine, but also, like, you could have looked before you left. I could just go. I can go out into the middle of the ocean if I want. No one can stop me. I have robot. You know, this is a true, true statement now. So I guess I, I guess I just won't be quiet about it. <laughs> uh. All right, let's get out. See if we can. Nope, I don't have the archaeological skills for that. Uh. And yep, uh. yep. Uh. Uh. Up the spine, continue up the rocky spine. Come on, keep going. More jumps. Zoom! Oh god. Nope, I'm not gonna make it. No! Ugh. Alright, well, let's. Ali, you? <laughs> I do also like that when you're in your scale, you can just run over small creatures. <laughs> Morbid, but okay. <laughs> well, they go like they go flying, and you do some amount of damage to them. Small creature go. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> And they take some amount of damage. Which, I mean, I guess feels like nice revenge if they've been ones that hurt you a lot, but also, like, morbid. Whee! Oh, got... Get, get, get. Ugh. Okay.
Boop. All right. All right. Here we go. Here we go. We're going to get it this time. We're going to get it. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh God. Damn it. Uh. Try so hard and come so far. And in the end, it doesn't even matter. I don't know how to lose it all. And in the end, it doesn't even matter. Oh, look, it's a cave. Cave time. Oh, God. Let's not stay in the cave. Why not? There's a lot of enemies in there. All like level 30. Do it in your cool. Uh, robot, while powerful, will still die. Important thing to note, your robot can only die X amount of times before you have to start paying for it to get rebuilt. And Do it in your cool. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Uh, party. Status. Can I check my skill? No, I cannot. I cannot check my skill from here. Why can I not check my skill? Um... Yeah, nope, I don't know. You're being extra persistent today, OP. Oh yeah, I got quests and stuff I was doing. Maybe I should do those. But why? I but know. There is robot. I'm just having fun being robot and stuff. There's another hour and 12 minutes until your food time. You'll be okay. I like how you can just bounce over rocks in this thing as well. It's just so good. Whoa. Where am I going? We Up this way. Down this way. Around this way. Right this way. Walk this way! Have you stopped being space racist? Never! Try some of this chocolate or whatever. Oh, it's still another case of kind of racist. Here, try my local delicacy. Oh, it's amazing, delicious chocolate. Yeah, it's made out of bugs. Ew! But you liked it before. Yeah, but that was before I knew it was made out of bugs. At least she's trying, I guess. Oh, our robot looks so cool. <laughs> have I mentioned I have a cool robot? <laughs> Not in the past two minutes. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> oh, okay. Fight. Fight the bird.
Stab the bird. Wow, I almost killed the bird already. Bird's dead. Well, that was fun. Zoom. Oh yeah, so this is a lake of acid that I can walk through because I have a robot and my friends cannot because they are not in robots. Damn shame that they're not in a robot. Don't do that, Opie. It's going to end in disaster. You know how I know? Because look my backpack you're trying to stand on and it will fall over. What? No, what? what am I fighting? Why? Oh, there's a thing here. Small bug. Fight the bug. I want to open the, the the weapon cache thing. I do appreciate how my friends are just standing in the acid and they're just like, yep, yeah, this is fine. <laughs> the AI just doesn't doesn't sometimes. Do, 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 do. Alright, level 29 guy flanked by two level 40s. <sighs> Can I take him? Oops, I did not mean to get out of my robot. Let's find out. I missed. Okay, you know what? Let's get out of the robot, because I don't think this is going to work. Time to run away. Those guys are, in fact, too strong. Well, at least you can say you tried. Yeah. Alright, I ran away. My robot's sitting over there, but that's fine. Thing we're actually here to do is go inside this cave. Hello. 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 <laughs> Hello, slightly racist lady. What's up? No, I haven't seen the, the the gal. Oh no. We need to save the friend. Into the cave we go. Do 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 do. Oh, things in here are only level like 20. Okay, we are the correct level for this. Cool. Bump, dump, dump, brown, brown. You know, I think this might be a shorter uh, stream. Yeah. Yeah. You finally got the robot, and now it's like, oh, success oh, is mine. Bless. Yeah. I mean, just saying, if you do anything about it now, we can go, uh... Mm -hmm. We can go watch Stephen and Malfoy Breath of the Wild blind live. Yeah. It's a good thing. Yeah. Oh, I might be able to do that raid functionality. That, because raiding is a thing you can do on Twitch. Oh. Yeah, we'll need to see if we can. I can figure that out. That'll be fun. Trying to see it looks like a little swan, and honestly, I see it. 
Fight the bat. Speaking of vampires. <laughs> Alexa, did you fall down? I think Alexa fell down. Fell down, go oop. I hate when they do that, when they, like, they're fighting and they just like don't notice the cliff edge. Just walk right off. And then they're just gone. You're like, oh, well, I guess I just won't have that team member. It's fine. Boop. It's not like I depend on these people or anything. No, no, it's fine, it's fine. I didn't need to live or anything. It's cool. Go die, I guess. Ugh, everything wants to fight me and I just don't care. Oh my god. I don't Hair. I just want to walk through this cave. Well, it's not gonna happen. Stop chasing me. Okay, I'll fight these things because they're here. <laughs> Fighty fight fight. Wait, why is one of my team members dead? Who died to the bats? Lynn? <laughs> Gonna have words once you come back to life. It's just a bat. And another bat and, and a plant. So really not a big deal. In fact, hold on. You, dummy, stand up. Look at that, immediately back at full health. Like, I don't even know how she died. Did she just fall, perhaps? Because sometimes when they fall, they respawn in weird ways. But, but like, there's no cliffs here. Well, did she, like... There's nowhere to fall. Well, but maybe she, like, I don't know, flipped into a wall. What are you guys... What are we fighting? Something on the other side of the map? Uh, Maya says, I bet they died because they don't have a robot. I mean, Lynn would die without having a robot while someone else does. Too distracted by other robots. I mean, also Alexa. Alexa is also probably super jelly. The only person that's not super jelly of our awesome robot is probably, uh, Elma. Mm -hmm. Elma's like, yeah, that's cool. I, whatever. Yeah, giant robot, whatever. Cool, man. Cool. I get it. Cool, we got a bunch of stuff. Go back into the cave. See if... Oh, uh, we can't even get the stupid... Ah! We can't get the thing. Because we're not a high enough level in our archaeological skills. 
Look, honestly, why why would you waste your time leveling up your archaeological skills? Especially when there's so many better things to level up. Like your scalp! Well, I, I don't think you can level up your... They level up in different ways. I'm just saying. Like your scalp. Okay. Alright, time to fight a bunch of robots. They're not robots. Buggos. Fight, fight, fight. Just see, no fun. It is just past eight. Okay. Well, I'm almost done with this quest, so once we're done with this quest, we'll figure out how raiding works. If they're live. If they're not live, then we'll do something else. And by something else, we'll just end the stream. <laughs> Sadly, or like, smartly enough, the game made it so that there are these caves that you can't take your robots into. So it's like, nope, you have to remember how to not just use robot all the time. It's the worst thing ever. I did it. The best friend. She's dead. Well, you were so racist, the alien died. Are you happy with yourself? Oh, wait, no, she's not dead. Good. I guess. <laughs> Men on our cute. Men on our cute. Oh, oh, okay. I thought we were talking about the racist one wasn't dead. Uh. Friendship. Yay! We helped one person get over their racism. If only we could do that on a national scale. And with that, we have new clothing. We have the di more diving body wear we can put on. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think that's going to be it. That's going to be it for this stream. Just to remind everybody, I have a giant robot, and it's awesome. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for coming and cheering us on. Hold him on, rather. I'm just, I'm just here. Well, that's okay. Oh, they are live. Okay, so uh, that's going to be it for this stream. How this is going to work is I'm going to figure out how to send the raid. But before that, I'm going to let you know what's coming up in the next week. On Monday at 6 p.m. Eastern Time, Tanil will be continuing in the Orange Gene Team Soul Silver game. I don't know how far we'll get, but hey, we have all the team members now and have almost all the badges, so that's cool. Uh, and more stuff will happen like that. 
And then uh, I don't know what we'll be playing on Friday. It might be more of this. It might be more Pokemon. It might be something else. Who knows? Uh, yeah. I, I don't think there's any premieres happening or anything like that. Oh, is it Sunday, Tennille? What? Yeah, Sunday. Drawing oh. a Blank comes back. On Sunday, whoop, whoop. Drawing a Blank shall return. It's been a while, but Tennille was working on building up a stockpile, so those will come back in full force starting on Sunday again. Those will be over on uh, Tennille Flowers on YouTube. And that's where you'll be able to find those. Either way, thank you everybody for watching. I'm going to run some ads on the way out, and then we're going to send on over to Stephen uh, and Mal. Stephen and Mal. Yay! I si I heavily suggest people watch Stephen and Mal. They're they're a good couple. Uh, they are playing a uh, Zelda game, Breath they of the are Wild, dear for and dear to my heart. Yes, they're playing Breath of the Wild for the first time ever. And is completely blind and it's great. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. So bye.